Before we start the reaction video, always remember to support the original content creator by using the links in the description below. Hey, what's up guys? It's Axel Grave back with more reactions with an X today, continuing on our Red vs. Blue Season 9 grind, doing episodes 15 and 16, The Sarcophagus. Uh, and I'm, I'm excited as always. Uh, there's only a couple more episodes left in the series season. That's this one, two, three, three episodes with us doing them two at a time. Uh, as always, remember to support Rooster Teeth and Red vs. Blue by using links in the description below. They deserve it. They make great content. If we don't watch and help support them in their channel, then they can't make more of it for us to react to. If you enjoyed watching, remember to hit like, comment, or critique below. Sorry, comment with a critique or a compliment below. Uh, we could use either, and both will help us to, you know, improve ourselves and the channel. We always can take advice. We're not perfect, and we know that. Uh, if you enjoyed watching, hit subscribe or on YouTube or follow on Twitch. You can see more of our stuff every day. We do uploads, and we do streams several times a week. And if you really, really want to get special access, you can go to patreon.com slash 3D, where for as low as a dollar a month, you can get up to a month's early, sorry, up to a week's, not a month's, I'm not that far ahead, up to a week's early access to all the content we make. Special shout out to our current patrons, you guys are the best, that we're actually doing this stream live to our patron stream, so they can come chat with us in the, in the middle of the episode if they'd like to. We're going to do a couple more of these, maybe some Ruby, or maybe some battle modes afterwards, and yeah. Anyway, let's get started and not wait any longer. That's already right, a minute and a half, and this is like a nine-minute episode. Jesus Christ. It's probably something small, Sorry, I gotta check for that. I almost want to take that one as a single, but it's fine. At least I'm not so tired of passing out like I was the other day, guys. That that was rough when I was filming these. And we remember to turn That's the air conditioner off. Hey, he got his trademark gun. Carolina, motion trackers indicate got an enemy team outside the door. Well, let's hope they're not as good at picking locks as you are, York. Right, to have Let's hope they're not better. Hit me. We found the markings we're looking for. The bad news is that. It's huge. Team A, I got us an exit up here. Straight up the stairwell, door to the roof, helipad. Copy. All radio air support. Now, how are we going to get that thing up to the roof? <laughs> I saw a window washing unit when we came into the facility. Can you find where it attaches to the building? Oh no, that's a tough one. Let me see what I can do. What are you up to? Improvising. Come here, Maine. She seems like a pretty good leader. Yeah, no, no lock pickers there. Better hurry, Maine. This should work fine. You're the only one heavy enough to counterbalance. Oh, don't be a baby. <laughs> don't be a baby. Hey, did you hear that noise? Probably the sound of you being an idiot. Oh, you're probably right. Who were those? Biscuit. Who were those? Dude? Dick biscuit, really? Dick biscuit. Packages here. Bjarnal cryogenics. I right missed there. the rest of the side. We're, oh. We're gonna need handcuffs. Is, is that a knife? Rifle? Knife? Well, that ought to buy us some time. I almost feel bad for the people down there. Don't. What? I said almost. Look at her walk with her saunter. Uh oh. Heavy armor, heavy gun. Oh, look at his helmet. Oh man, I wonder how much that took of editing for them to add. What the fuck is with this guy? Oh, this one, the, the little bopper. So this existed when they made this, huh? They must have made this then. What the hell? It bounces? Who designed a gun that bounces? This is the worst gun ever. Of all time. <laughs> this is the worst gun ever. Of all time. Here she goes. Wow. Then she's gonna kick it at him. Nice fucking explosion.
Oh, the fucking energy thing. Nice. That guy was a dick. Come on. <laughs> fucking watch. Plane, that was just showing off. <laughs> the other one just falls. There. I ought to hold him for a while. Okay, maybe not. Hey, where's me? I like how they're immediately. Man, I almost feel bad for them. That's what I said. Four seven nine er, this is Team Alpha. That's what I said. Back on the roof of the tower. Roger that. I'm on it. Come on, it's up here. You. What are you doing here? Is that a bomb? I knew it. It was you who blew up the oil platform. That thing blew up? Somebody's been covering our tracks. You were on the roster too, but they hid your name. Why did they send you? Hey, hate to bust up the reunion here, but we got a problem. Damn, Texas is big. Let's go, 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 now! Get in a position! I would say she's a big woman, but she's a big AI. No one gets behind me! Drop your weapon! You, dickhead! Disarm the bomb! Easy, easy. No reason to get all dramatic. Okay, let me take a crack. Hey, fucking do it already. Easy, easy, man. Uh, this isn't a bomb. It's a transmitter. All right, it's not a bomb. Wait, a transmitter? What's it transmitting? Our location. Uh. Why would it do that? System online, Director. Awaiting your command. If I may, Director, I think it would be wise if we... Shut up, Counselor. Of course, sir. Oh, Lord. He's gonna fire a space gun! Run, idiots! Run! What the hell? There were four of them here! What the fuck is going on? What did I say? Wow, what she hella I disguised. So that's her that power is me. stealth. Hey, you mind holding this for me for a second? Well, thank you. Wow. Firing main oh wow. Wonder how they get away with this. I was gonna say a space gun would fuck shit up. Man, they must be really heavy. Oh, now the building falls. Go, you crazy freelancer bastards! I like Connecticut. I didn't like her that much when I first watched through, but I like her. She's got like a good sense of humor and a lot of other stuff going on. There it is. Damn, look at this animation style. This is why... This is what originally got me into Rooster Teeth's animation game and, and to Ruby at one point. Which, once again, it sucks that it took me so long to get into Ruby, but for me, Red vs. Blue is still by far one of my favorites. Like, not just this stuff, like, the, the action sequences are outstanding. But the story in Red vs. Blue is also really well written for something that's originally a comedy uh, show. You know what I mean? Yep, I was about to say, that was if that one was so entertaining, it didn't even feel like that long. Like, I don't feel like this was an eight-minute episode. I love the track. I forget who they have doing this, but this is their original, like, hip-hop track that Rooster Teeth used in a bunch of their commercials around this time. Oh, and then she's going out. That was interesting. <laughs> that was interesting. Alright, alright, next episode. Hell's Angel. Come on, man, help me. I need to find a way to have her stick around a bit longer. Oh, yeah, sure, no problem. Maybe you and your girlfriend could find time to go on a killing spree. Do some real bonding. Tucker. Oh, that's right. Not your girlfriend. 
Just the girl that you're stalking through multiple planes of existence. Ugh. Romantically. Please, I just need a little more time. Why? Who cares? I do! I'm supposed to do this! Fine. Where is she now? She's talking with Caboose. Well, that should keep her busy for at least a few minutes. Half an hour if she starts asking him math problems. Hey, I'm gonna stick around a while longer. You are? I mean, you are? Yeah. Caboose <laughs> here said you guys need some help with the tank, so I figured uh, I could help with that too. What can I say? I like the kid. Plus, I paid her a hundred dollars. Yeah, that too. Money. <laughs> what did I think of that? Because you don't have any money? Good point. Hey, come on, <laughs> take money. Okay. Wait. Is this a trick? I'll pay you a hundred dollars to show me how it works. <laughs> you guys God damn it. Lopez and not me. What do you expect? He had the perfect disguise. He painted himself maroon. Badly. Exactly. How can anyone be expected to see <laughs> that? He's Spanish. No one else does. That did seem weird at first, but... You always go through those annoying phases. Like, the time you learned to play banjo, or the time you were going to be a vegan. What do you mean, phases? I am a vegan, and I can play the banjo. I know, and isn't all that annoying? But you couldn't figure it out. <sighs> you don't know me at all. To be fair, we didn't know Lopez either. We knew you both equally as little, so you can see how we'd get confused. Also, we didn't really care. Yeah, but Lopez was here a day. I've been here for years. Years. Now, see, I'm learning new stuff about you already. Now the next time an evil robot tries to take your place, I'll have questions to ask it. Shit. <laughs> Why am I the one cleaning up my own body? This is insulting. Hey, what do you think I was using all this equipment for? I don't know, boring stuff? Who cares? Yes, boring stuff oh, to save wait, your guys' life. Forgot. You like boring stuff. Never mind what I said. I'm sure it's something for sports. It looks like we have a mystery to solve. What Damn you, it. <laughs> hey, uh, what are you, 12? Hey, you sure. What do you want to talk about? No, not you, Caboose. I want to talk to Tex. Oh. <laughs> Go ahead. I want to talk to her alone. You can't talk to someone alone. There has to be two people. <laughs> I don't make them. Bye. You are right, Caboose. No. Well, I, I suppose she could stand really far away, and then you could yell. That might that might work. Caboose, I Fuck. would like for you to leave. Oh, I I get it. I'm so, I'm so embarrassed. I'll just go over there for a little while. Thank you. Come on, Tex. No, 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 no. Tex, te please, can you help me out here? Oh, no, no, no. I'm sure this conversation is a lot more entertaining than whatever you want to say to me. <laughs> Thanks for gathering so quickly. It appears we have a crisis on our hands. I'm now going to turn this meeting over to our chief science engineer, Simmons. <sighs> Finally, some respect. Who's going to talk for a little while, but not too much. He's not going to over-explain things in that way he does, and then he's going to stop talking and turn the meeting back over to me. Simmons? Thank you, Sarge. They look really similar. Analyzing the equipment that Lopez was using, I have found that the planet is undergoing a total seismic breakdown. There's clear evidence of an unstoppable chain of events which is leading to a full systemic collapse. Now I realize this may cause some of you to panic. Or not. Or it may confuse most of you because you don't understand what I said. Can we wrap this up, please? The world is breaking. We're all gonna die. What? Why would you tell us like that? It's like ripping off a band-aid! You know what? <laughs> Fuck you guys. It's like Stupid ripping off the band-aid. Life of worry and fear? You're all doomed. This is the worst news ever. <laughs> Stupid There's people no get to live a life of worry and fear. Place to resolve the problem. I can't wait to hear this. Now we all know that the planet Kick is Kick the planet's ass. We need to destroy Look at him trying. Scare the crap out of it. What? Oh my god. What's that bad sci-fi movie where they discover a natural disaster and their first attempt to solve the problem is to use a huge bomb? That's every bad sci-fi movie, sir. Exactly. So that's what we're going to do. Now here's the plan. We're going to build an enormous drilling machine. Now they did a pretty planet. decent job at doing a tri-quarter planet. They didn't get the top like runner in the center, but it's pretty good. Set off an enormous bomb to stabilize the planet. How will a bomb stabilize the planet? It won't. Duh. But through a series of dramatic setbacks, calamities, and yes, hopefully a few of us dying on the mission. Oh God. Obviously, grit. And save the world. Seriously? I like the plan. Me too. Let's do it. Great. I'll get to work on the drill. Donut. You find the deepest, darkest hole where we can stick it in. I have a list of candidates right here. Griff, I need you to build us a bomb. <laughs> oh my god. Run away, son. Time is short. Okay, uh, I guess I'll look on the internet? Excellent. <laughs> to work, man. Hey, the answer's uh, there. The fight. Let me save. Whatever. Team B report. Team B. Team B is down. We have oh. wounded and are taking fire. It's will be right there. Negative. Get the package. Head it out of the city. Roger that. Reading Team B's tracker. Okay, there he is, I got him. We'll cut him off at the overpass. Go, go! Ugh, oh, look at those chest mounted fucking right there. Stabilizers! Stabilizers. Go ahead, Phyllis. I need 
need you to fire Ordnance Pod 0401 to my position. I am sorry, but I cannot verify the contents of that pod. Protocol dictates just that all... Just fire it, Phyllis. Acknowledged. Safety protocol... I love how he's just like... Pod oh, fuck, did the... The screen went out? Yeah, the fucking camera just went out. I'm gonna pause it just a moment. Sorry, guys. It fucking literally just went out. I hate when it does that. Doesn't tell me. Or it's just like boop. Luckily, I was paying attention this time. Hello there. Oh. Hey, A motorcycle! Yeah! Oh, that? Yeah, yeah. Wow, that's an interesting motorcycle screech sound. They almost sound more like bicycle screeches across like a uh, gym court floor. Sorry, dude. That was 15 and 16. I can't believe that was actually a really long set of episodes. It was going to be a long one for Red vs. Blue, but it was so good. The first one was so good, I didn't even notice how long it was. You know what I mean? Like, it's it's tough to explain. I have to fucking... Ah, I can't move into the correct positioning. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I'm trying. But as always, remember to support Red vs. Blue and Rooster Teeth. Sorry about the camera k off. We're going to continue Season 9 right now and in the future, and hopefully you guys all enjoy it. We're, we're getting slowly and slowly farther ahead in our uh, schedule so that we can actually do extra stuff for you guys. And, you know, aside from the shit that we're doing now, I didn't even notice I had moved that, so it needs to come back a bit. Yeah, there we go. That's better anyway. Anyway, thanks, guys. Uh, you know, come chat it up with us in the Discord in the link below, and I'll catch you next time on Reactions with an X.